Hey everybody, it's Savage Sage, and welcome to the finale of Grandia 2 HD Remaster on Hard Mode. I don't care how long this video is going to take, we are going to get to the end today. So strap in, grab your popcorn, and smash that like button to show your support for the series. And consider subscribing if you haven't already, because only about half of you guys that watch my content are subscribed, and it does help me out quite a lot. As you guys probably know, hopefully from watching the last episode, and if you didn't, I suggest you go back and kind of catch yourself up. But we are inside of Valmar right now. Yes. And he, we didn't even buy him dinner. It's pretty sick, actually. But, oh, this is the wrong way. And that's why it's like, you, you can't have a Grandia game without all the organic dungeons. So we're here with the organic dungeons, and we're, we're dungeoning. <laughs> that's all. So let's continue on. Most of the enemies here so far have proven to be pretty easy. Ew, there's like eggs in here. I don't even want to know what part of Valmar we're in right now. But I don't. Just the same Valmar moths that we fought in the last boss fight. So essentially killed in one hit. I mean, I used Sky Dragon Slash on that one, but I'm sure Crackling or Hellburner would work just as well. Threat. So that's good to know, actually, is the Valmar moths seem to be strong against fire because Hellburner. Only did like a thousand damage to him, so we'll uh, use Tio to get rid of those moving forward. Are there any items in here or anything? No? Just you nasty moths and eggs? Well, respectfully, I'm not that interested in nasty moths inside of eggs, so I'm gonna leave you behind. People. Yeah, pretty much Tio is destroying everything right now, and she's not even like the main one. I mean, she's probably my fastest character right now, and actually, let's go ahead and give these all-around seats to you, Tio. Then for men, let's give that to you, Roan. Just so Tio can keep growing strong and doing some crazy shit. I love it. Alright. Holy Sword Armor. I'm assuming that's something I want to give to Ryudo, but let's check. Raises power of moves. Hell yeah, Ryudo. There you go, boy. I don't know why that's just chilling inside of Valmar's body, but, you know, it's fine. I don't have to ask questions. I just gotta get through here. Ew, is there any other reason to come through this egg room? There must be, right? It's not just for that. Right? I feel like I'm missing something, because I felt like this was the only way to go. And also, it'd be kind of weird to have this whole, whole room and section just for armor. But maybe it is. Maybe I'm overthinking it, cause yeah, okay. <coughs> well shit, Valmar's body. We'll find another way to go then. I kinda wish there was items or something in some of these eggs, or we could break them open or something, but it's not the case, it wasn't meant to be, we'll just have to get over that dream, oh well. Well, I mean, if it's right here and it's free, sure, I'll take the recover, fuck. Oh, fuck yeah, bud. Free recover? Fuck yeah. Let's go this way, then. Or is this the way that I came? Yeah, this is the way that I came. God. I don't know why I allow myself to get so freaking combuzzled on this stuff. Yeah, this is nowhere. Okay, hold on. Are you trying to tell me that we're officially confused? I don't want that. Is this the way I just went? Yes. Alright, and I was looking at it like this, I just walked up, so let's try this way? I don't fucking know. No, that's to Valmar 1. And we came up in here. What? Guys, am I being stupid? Am I getting punked right now? Over here, what's this? This is the egg room again. Is it the same egg room? Yes. So then they most they bust blah, 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 blah. they must both lead to egg rooms. And I'm just getting twisted and I keep running away from the actual egg room I need to go to. Or there's two of these rooms. Oh, that's what was getting me. There's two of these rooms and I was thinking of this room earlier that I did. Okay, okay, okay. Well give me the helmet. God of War Helm. Love that. Let's see. Reduces IP slowing. There you go, Ryudo. Ryudo's gonna be a monster by the end of this, which is exactly what I want. There's enemies in there, but there's no really reason to fight them. Let's... Aw, oh, man. 
Let's open up these other ones that I can't quite see. Like you. Picked on the wrong people. Yeah, Tio's like, you are trash. <laughs> yes. They're not giving us very many magic coins at this point, which is kind of rude. Ooh, 9,000. I really don't think that matters right now. Ugh, there's gonna be these eggs everywhere. I just don't want to deal with them. Because the Valmar Master Threat eliminated. Yeah, like the mobs are just kind of annoying and they don't even give you that many things. So it's like, what the heck, bud? What the actual heck? Easy stuff, easy stuff. Ooh, another meteor scroll. Cool, I guess. Thank you, question mark. Ugh, gross little eggs everywhere. Another Yomi's elixir. We will always take that. Thank you. I've definitely used my fair share. I think against Melphis I used the most. Which makes sense. Melphis is a bastard. Ugh. Everything in here is so organic. And it's disgusting, actually. But at least we can use it to walk around. That's the, This is the same room with the save room, I'm pretty sure. Like, where we first came in. Ew, this switches stuff back. Okay, fine. Do it. The way it fucking... Here, hold on. Alright, sorry about that. I'll probably cut that out. I just ended up getting a phone call that I wanted to take, so I did. Oh shit, we were going this way. So I got a little confused, a little turned around there. But we're back in business! Let's continue on. Okay, so this is a, yet another save point, actually. It's not the same room. They're just really trying to confuse us. So what's over this way, then? Ugh, eggs. Disgusting. Oh wait, no, that's the same way, because that moth is already broken out. I'm pretty sure, I mean, that does look familiar, so maybe this is the same save room and I just couldn't get to that gold earlier. Girl, I don't fucking know. This looks new, just because there's enemies everywhere. So that were, oh, this is gonna raise all of them. Just for what, that one item? Those two items? I don't know if I wanna do all that. We'll maybe come back to it. Oh shit. A holy ghost staff. Okay, Elena, that's for you, girl. Nice. And it cuts our MP consumption even more. They want us to be overpowered at this point. They want us to murder everything. Oh, you have to do it just to get to the door. Fine, fine. We'll do it. If it's necessary, which it seems like it is. Actually, I think those are new enemies right there. So, it's more of the brain Elvises. I don't think we've seen these since, like, the beginning of the game. But here's our cousins, the Mind Eaters. Disgusting! Mind Eaters! Let's do it. We're doing Wait. it live. Go ahead and crush them. Let's see. Is anybody going to survive Tio's bullshit this time? Nor, they're not. You picked on the wrong people. Sure did. Tio is not going to take any of that shit. Alright, well, just like everything else, just fucking do that to them once and they're dead. Mystic Potion, thanks, I'll take it. What is this? What are you? Shat scattering Stone, like I use that stuff. Also, those guys sound gross. Did you hear him going... Bleh. I just don't know if I'm necessarily committed to the idea of fighting all the enemies in here because they're not even giving me that much. Wait a minute. Now that looks familiar. This is going to take me back out to the fucking save room, isn't it? What in the horse shit is this? Ugh. I feel betrayed. Oh, the stairs are open. Hold on. Do you see that? That's new. Ah ha ha ha! I found the way! God, sorry. It just takes me a minute. I'm a little dumb. Yeah, slice Valmar up, dude. Fuck you. Get your nasty little organs out my way! Ya bitch. Ouch fuck off. Usually I like the interactive environment in Grandia games, but right now it's disgusting because it's your body, so please stop. Now we're in the blood passages. This game's real gross, actually. I'm pretty sure you don't want to get hit by that thing. 
You picked on the wrong people. Picked on the wrong people. Ooh, an all-around seed. We love that. We'll use that for Miss Teo again, probably, since she's fucking just crushing everything. Hello! Meter scroll, face paint, priestess robe. Okay. And the only thing I care about there is the priestess robe. All status disorder resistance. Yeah, I'm doing that, for sure. That's so much better than just a little bit of defense that it could offer me. Alright, let's see. Oh! I almost got fucking murdered there. Did you see that? That was scary. Ah, uh, They're causing slowdown, too. What the fuck? You don't even connect anywhere. Girl. Girl, what's happening? a new room? Oh, this is how we get down to the... Alright, fuck. The wrong people. They show sure did, Tio. You tell them. Hell yeah. Nice. I pray that we shall be safe ahead. There you go, Elena. Popping off. Those mind eaters actually do give a bit of magic coins, so that's cool, because that's, I mean, mainly what I'm looking for at this point. I like the other coins, don't get me wrong, but the mana coins are kind of where it's at right now. Oh yeah, they do just do damage. I guess I don't need to avoid them, avoid them. I mean, they're annoying, but... Um, people. Damn, there's those dumb moths in here, too, that don't give a shit, but they do apparently drop Yomi's elixirs occasionally, so that's cool. Let's get through here. How oh, way am I? I gotta look. Oh god. One of those games where you're... I mean, one of those games. This is one of those dungeons where you kill all the enemies. Not because you need the experience, but just to know where the fuck you're going. At least that's me. <laughs> Valmar's body is a little bit of a bitch, in my opinion. Ooh, a golden potion. I'll take it. Thank you. But yeah, don't be afraid to use any of your items or stuff to give yourself more MP or if you need anything like that because, quite honestly, what the hell else are you going to use it for? You're not, so just do it. Just do what I say. Oh. But there's plenty of recovery points, it seems like. So if this is the right way, actually, hold on. If this is the right way, I want to go to the wrong way. Over here, because I think there's a chest. Yes. Um, Ogre Shoes is probably the only thing in there that I care that much about. Let's check them out. Rudo, you want them? Move like an ogre. I don't really know what that means. And I don't really want to find out. Move like an ogre? Do they move fast or something? I don't... Whatever. Anyways, we're gonna move on and come up into this oh ho, ho! I'm actually gonna skip this it's just two of them Threat eliminated. yeah they were wildly too easy it was just two of the same boss that we fought last time so just murdered it real quick Morde. is that a yeah no is that Valmar's vagina yeah, the last missing body piece that you never thought we'd run into, we have now. Let me go ahead and just, you know. <laughs> you know. Alright. Let's continue on. Into the core. Hello, Valmar's core. It's real gross in here. There's eyeballs and blood cells. It's nasty, okay? Just trust me. Zara, We know you're in here! You have done well. But alas, not well enough, for the Earth tires of bearing the weight of humanity and begs for destruction. End this foolishness, for you seek your own ruin. No, you are not the human soul, cannot dis exist without darkness. Does not darkness rule your every action? How then will you contend with your own master, your own god, Ryudo? Who put your faith in a dead god? Who will hear your songs now? In whom will you believe? A dead god or a living one, Elena? Descendant of the people of darkness, 
Honor your ancestors by serving me now as they did long ago. Hide not from your destiny, Rowan. You, my servant, if you wish to be complete, then you must obey me, for you were created for no other purpose than this, Tio. Oh, pitiful fools, surrender your hearts to me, and I may yet spare you. To lose our hearts is to lose our very own humanity. We know each other not through our eyes or ear. Oh, I will not become a monster knowing only of madness and bloodshed. My soul and I will not sacrifice from empty promises of power. You have now renounced your heart, your own heart. You are a mindless beast who only plays at the beings of God. I buddy, playtime is over. God, gotta read fast there. I believe in Ryudo and in people. To love people is to save them. And I finally realized this. I'm not hitting the buttons either. So what if we were the people of darkness? The past has no more hold on us. It is not destiny that binds people to the past. It is you, and we shall be free. You are mistaken. I am complete. I have a heart. We are. N we have no need for the gods who use us as tools. We are neither your puppets nor your playthings. We are your destruction. Well, well, then show me your pitiful power, and I will show you exactly how powerless you truly are. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> Sorry, I added my own little epic music there. I hope you don't mind. I thought that was a cool transition, personally. Here is the core of Valmar. Now, even though it likes to try to, like, act like this is the final boss, it's not. So, don't get your hopes too up, but it is a fight. Oh, stars above. We're gonna be going all out here, just because, I mean, I feel like we have to. to my voice. Please listen to Tio! Listen to Grandma Tio. She will guide you correctly. Let rain on me. Tio is Lady Gaga, actually. Dead Claw. Most everything is going to go for Roan, which is the plan. Let's go ahead and Sky Dragon Slash on him. They're going to do some things. They're going to burn flame. Like, we are going to get hit some, so don't get too worried or freaked out about it. Um, just kind of do your own thing, and eventually we'll get ahead of them. You shall be defeated. Take that. Sky Dragon Slash. Yes, Ryu, to pop off on him. See, that did decent damage, but this is like a boss. It's not just like, you know. That was a kind of a hard-hitting one, just a laser on us. We're going to keep whispering to the stars, though. Elena, we're going to go ahead and let you, girl, do uh, probably Dragon Zap, I guess. Right to the core itself. This should do a decent amount of damage. If not, I'll switch over to like either a Hellburner or like Baboom even. But I'm pretty sure Dragon Zap is gonna do some decent damage for us right now. Ah, that was actually pretty shitty damage. Um, for you, let's go ahead and refresh you. Oh, stars above. Please listen to my voice. So yeah, I'll try Baboom instead. Just to see if that does more damage from Elena. Or I might even just hit him with a white apocalypse for a while too. All is one! They go round, because I want you up and ready to um What am I trying to say? I want you available to heal when shit goes down. I know, you guys are probably sick of this. I shall reveal the power of God. Oh yeah, he does have all healer and stuff. Like, this battle can be tough, but it's not going to be anything too crazy for us. Oh, Especially so once we get all buffed up. Please listen to my voice. Which that is what Miss Tio is for. Perfect! We're all level 3 on that stuff now. 
Ryudo, go ahead and do your signature again. Let's see, what are you doing? Burn Flame, I don't care that much about that. Roan, let's go ahead and just do an all healer of our own, just to get everything back on track here. Sworn enemies, you shall be defeated! Because this thing is not really making a dent in us as much as we're denting in it. So we just want to keep that trend going. There we go. That was some good damage. Look at the chunks from all of them. I shall reveal the power of God. The power of God is burn flame, bro. We've had that since like episode two. Just saying. Just saying, just saying, we've had that power. T.O., let's do it one more time, girl, just to be really dramatic. There you go, all better. Yeah, Roan's like, girl, we don't give a fuck. Let me release you from your suffering. Oh, is this a buff clearer? Ah, oh, if it is, I'm gonna be sad. It is, I forgot about it. That's fine, because guess what Tio's doing right now? Stars above. Please listen to my I kind of forgot he had Vanish. Very disappointing. Well, that's fine. At least we'll have the one going off. And then I'll probably just have Tio start attacking. Um, because I don't want to keep wasting her turn on Whisper of the Stars if he's just going to Vanish often. So let's just at least get one stack on all the time. Oh, tainted ones. Get him, Elena. Yes, snipe them. Nice. That was three damage, uh, three thousand on them all, so that's good. I shall reveal the power of God. Bro, all healer is kind of old news too. I shall reveal the power of God. Amateurs. Amateur hour out here. Alright, there you go. Start popping off, Queen. White. White. Yep, <laughs> I was like, I'm pretty sure she just says white. Uh, it seems like he's just pretty much resistant to most magic. There you go, Roan. Take that heat for everybody. Good boy. Merciful to the dead? Okay. <laughs> Roan, stop that! Yeah, that's the thing. The only complaint I really have about Grandia is, like, when you're doing long battles like this, it's just, like, all animations over and over and over again. The animations are a little bit too long, in my opinion. They're epic. I love them. But after you've seen them, like, 50 times, like, say we do a Let's Play or something, um, at, towards the end of it, you're like, all right, stop showing me these fucking animations. Fun fact, they don't stop. Can't stop, won't stop. Rone's just taking all the heat for everybody, which is fine. Just keep it going. Ice. Ice. There we go. Nice. Icy cold. So she's doing about like 3,000 to everybody. Day of Judgment. Oh. Well, it's straight up using the power of Valmar itself. That is a cool animation. I'll admit it. In fact, it keeps getting cooler. I'm glad we at least showed this off. Oh my god. I mean, that did kind of hurt everybody. Elena, let's have you try Baboom this time instead. See how much that does. And then Roan, obviously. Get your job. Because Roan is our healer. 
That Day of Judgment did do some damage to us. Yeah, and he's just gonna consistently heal for a while. It's fine. Just let it go. Come. Release the ultimate light. Yes. Splash. Boom! I think this animation is pretty dope. Not gonna lie to you. 10 out of 10 is pretty cool. There you go, all better. Hell yeah, thanks, Roan. I'll probably just have Roan heal every turn from now on. Because he can take most hits. That kind of sucks because we're all... Maybe I should do something about that. Tio, can you spread us out, girl? Respectfully. I shall reveal the power of God! Ugh, this animation specifically is so loud and long for no reason. It's such a good spell, though. It's so cool, but what the fuck, bro? Poor Roan get his, he's getting his cheeks clapped a little bit. Silver. Yes. Move us around. Spread us out specifically. Hopefully Roan is away from everybody else. Because that's what we're looking for here. Lit and drop him. Kind of separate. Hey! Aw, poor Roan. He is getting close there. Maybe we should take a time. Um... Where's the... Healing herb is to all friends. Scroll of all heal is all friends. This is what I want. Let's use one of these. Just so then we're safe. I don't want to mess around and like let one person die and then everything goes to shit after that. That doesn't sound fun, does. So, that's what we'll do. That feels good. Hey! Roan doesn't care, though. All healer again. What a loser. Let's do another Whisper to the Stars. Let's just try to sneak it in there. Stars above, please listen to Because I don't think he'll do Vanish again, but he might. But even if he does do Vanish, it's a waste of his turn. And up until that point, we're going to be doing damage. I actually didn't pay attention to how much damage Baboom did. I was just so excited about the animation itself. I should probably check that out. Oh, God damn it. Burn strike for real. Stop that! Get out of my face, dog. White Apocalypse. Get him, Elena! He's tainted hoes. Yeah, get him, Elena. Send him back. Send him packing, bro. Yes. There you go. 3,000 damage on all of them. Roan, you can go ahead and refresh yourself, bud. Ryudo, you know. Sky Dragon Slash, that seems to do the most deep damage. Um, Lotus Flower, what are you trying to do? Hammer Claw? Uh. Well, it could potentially Lotus Flower. cancel him, and I don't want that. So there you go. Cancel two of them. That works. That's why I love her Lotus Flower. Let's work at it. Boom, there you go, Rowan. Sworn enemies, you shall be defeated! Take that! Hell yeah, once we get at least one of the faces or something dead, we'll be straight chilling, but... For right now, this is what we're dealing with. Ooh, we're getting close, though. Once we... Once Ryudo starts really popping off here, we'll be good. But yeah, definitely one of the tougher battles in the game, so don't feel any certain type of way. 
Howl Slash. I mean, I guess decent move because it's a line move, so you got around there. Nice. All healer, yeah, what a shock. Who's that hitting too, Ryudo? The Destruction Lights of Rude One. I actually might use Tio's turn as like a healer plus on Roan. Because he needs it. Luminance 7401. There you go, Roan. You're back up to code. Ugh, this thing. Ryudo might be dead here, and that would suck. Just because he has the lowest HP. But since I healed Roan, I don't feel too bad about it. Oh, he's okay. Oh, what? Did I just have her attack or some shit? That was stupid. Yeah, now Ryudo's dead. God damn it. Elena, I don't know why I had you do that, girl. But all anyway, let's do an all healer right now. Get everybody back on track. What are you doing? Zap all. That does kind of suck, but I don't care that much. Let's resurrect Ryudo. Light blue. Damn, he gets resurrected just in time to get hit with zap all again. Yeah, let's get back on our feet here, because that was just a blunder on my part. I should have used Elena to do like impact bomb or something and cancel that, but. Oh well, it is what it is, on, right? Everyone. Snap to it! Snap to it, says Roan. I was like, don't be fucking stupid here. Get out get back on your ass. Oh lightning! I command thee! He's commanding the lightnings, eh? He paralyzed Roan. That's probably the worst thing that happened in that situation. So I'll probably use Tio to heal that, but. Damn, they're just really popping off on us right now. I'm not a fan. Please stop! Stop playing animation for one minute so I can think, damn it. Ron's poor little unconscious body just chilling there. Alright. Hammer claw on Ron, that's actually kind of okay. While Ron is paralyzed, let's go ahead and take the responsibility here and do the Azura potion with Tio. Just to make sure everybody's okay. Ron being paralyzed sucks, but it'll be okay until he comes back, I think. Please, take this. Let's see here. Let's do another baboom on him. And then, no, Ryudo, you do Sky Dragon Slash on him. Between the two of them, they should be doing some decent damage. I don't think we're going to quite Come, kill anything yet. But at least it'll be stunned for half a second so everybody can get back on their feet. I might have Tio use like Halva or something. If she has that. I'm pretty sure she does. On Roan. Sworn enemies, you shall be defeated! Take that! Sky Dragon Slash! Noise, noise, let's do it. Get him, get him. Ooh, I think one face might have died. No, they're still both there. He's very close, though. Howl Slash, that's okay. Oh, no.
We do need to kind of like respread out. Of oh, spellbinding eye. I forgot he can use the other Valmai things. Who's that gonna hit? Hopefully Roan. If it's Roan, I don't care that much. Oh, it is. Okay. Sorry, Roan. Respectfully, I don't care that much. What are you doing? Day of Judgment? Yeah, no. Oh, fuck me, dude. Um. I don't think there's going to be able, any way to stop the Day of Judgment hit, but hopefully I can kill some of the other, like, at least one of the masks or something, so it's easier for me to recover. That's Ice. that's what I'm thinking. Hopefully that works out. I'm not sure. Because he's going to do the Day of Judgment anyway. Did I get one of them? I think I got one. Ugh. This fucking animation again. I mean, it's a cool animation, don't get me wrong, I just don't want to see it ten times. And it does do damage to my party, which I'm also not a fan of. Ooh, yeah, we need to heal bad. Well, that's gonna kill somebody. Roan, maybe? Elena. Oh. So dramatic in this game. Teos are fastest, and that's kinda good. Owl Slash could kill Roan too. That sucks. Sure didn't actually. Hmm. Roan's a trooper. What are you doing? Hammer Claw and Roan. Okay. Um. Ooh, a hero's elixir for Elena. Let's do it. Cause then she'll come back and just do damage. Rone's still alive after that? Oh my, what a fucking monster. Stop that. Please, take this. There you go, Elena. Better than we could have asked for, so she's fucking set. Ryuta, we're gonna use you right now to do... Is there not something better I could use right now? Hmm. Alright, I think the best thing I can do right now is the healing incense, so let's do it. Oh, that might get around finally. It was bound to happen, dude. Sorry, Roan. But we'll at least get this off, everybody will be back, and then we'll heal, we'll revive Roan, and then just go back to the slaughterhouse that we were doing. Quake! We don't got time for quakes. If that hits anybody but Ryudo, I'm okay. Okay, cool. Alright, hold on here. This is what we're gonna do now. Miracle Elixir on Roan. What are you trying to do, dude? Vanish? Fuck, no, you're not gonna use Vanish right now. Elena's like, I'm fucking stacked right now, dude. Why would I let you use Vanish? Nope. Get that shit out of my face. Please, take this. Roan is back in the building. Burn strike and vanish again. Ugh. The vanish kind of sucks and the burn strike is whatever. But let's get an all healer off on everybody so then we're just feeling better about life. 
fine, fine. You use Vanish. I'm not a fan of it, but I get it. We were pretty stacked up. What are you trying to do? Burn Strike on Elena? I mean, hopefully she can survive that, because I am going to use... Where is it? What do I want to use? Let's use the Nut of Life on Ryudo. He looks I like he needs a good Nut of Life. Of Our Light, I guess. Striker. Elena might die, and that would suck. I could use Dio to revive her, maybe. Oh, she lived. What a liver. Good job. There you go. All better. Because then this puts us kind of back on track here. Okay, cool. Oh! That's on everybody? I didn't even realize that. Well, shit. Now we're chilling. Ooh, you're trying to use Destruction Light? I don't like that that much. The left head's almost dead. The middle head still doesn't have its HP on it, huh? Well, I want to spread out a little bit anyway. And so this will scramble us, move us around a little bit. Now we're getting to a point where we're like, we can kill you. The right head's already gone, the left head's going right now. Perfection. You're just attacking. You're trying to use destruction light, which I'm not a fan of, so just don't. Here goes my impact bomb. And uh yeet. Haha. <laughs> That's what you get. Alright, so let's get up here again. Roan, go ahead and do your thing, man, and just do an all healer. Um, we'll obviously use, have you use Sky Dragon Slash, and then um, for Tio, I guess what, Crackling? That is like her best thing. White. 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 Oh, oh. Crashing down on him. Decent damage, decent damage. Getting everybody Come all on, healed up and ready, choice. that's great. That do be feeling good. Sworn enemies, you shall be defeated! Take that! Sky Dragon Slash! Wonderful pop off, Ryudo. Nice. We almost have that middle head killed and then it's just working on the core. Dead Claw, that's whatever. Oh, you didn't even get Roan that time with the status. And Destruction Light, that's been one of the more annoying things. But when we're spread out, it doesn't really affect me as much. So, kudos, question mark. Dead Claw, that's fine. Let's go ahead and do White Apocalypse one more time. That'll remove the middle head. Ones. Return to the world of darkness. Boom. Nice. Now it's just you, so fast dance whirl. And you're under 10,000 HP, so we got this in the bag now. Twenty-two hundred, not bad, not bad. Not like great either, but not bad. Hey, what you trying to do, Day of Judgment? Absolutely fucking not, dude. Ten say can slash. Yeah, get that shit out of here. Hammer claw. Um. Yeah, you don't really have anything around right now because of the move block. That's okay. We'll here just keep doing our thing. I'll use Roan to kind of slow him down on the IP gauge. 
Nice. Oh, that didn't cancel. Weird. Well, he's probably going to cancel you then, Ron. Oh, no. He finally got us. He hit us all with that. Well, you know, the best you could do on one target must be from Gadzap, right? 2045 is all he has. I'm sure she can end it. Right here and now. More it is. Come, Thunder. Shake the heavens. Ah, only 1808? What the hell? Well... With a classic 10 second slash, Ryuta will finish it. Can slash. There you go, friends. Is dead. Zikor Valmar is dead. And welcome to the false summit. It makes it think like that was the final boss, but it's not. It cannot be thus. Why? How can mere humans possess such power? Because we're not stark raving mad, you pathetic blockhead. Now you realize the true power of humanity. The power of humanity? A weak and mortal heart? How can you place faith in such fallible things? Then I will let you see a familiar face. Oh, wings of Valmar, come back now. Millennia? I thought you were dead. Millennia, is that you? Ryudo, give me the horns. I was taken from you because I did not possess them. I can't continue my existence without them. Ryudo, please. Fake asshole. Stop it! Don't you know me, Millennia? Ryudo, that is not Millennia. What? What? Millennia? She never used to care for anyone but herself. She was as selfish as a child, yet she was an innocent, as innocent as a child. But Millennia came to love us. If that were the real Millennia, she would never do this. Ryudo, do you not understand? She only looks like Millennia. This is deception. She doesn't even sound like Millennia. Y you're right. Millennia is somewhere else. Yes, I understand now. Go away, you imposter. And now we have to fight Millennia herself. Well, fake Millennia. Um... Let's just start off with... Oh, she's just trying to combo. That's fine. Let's get Zapper. Let's actually... Hold on. Oh, holy thunder. That was good damage. Um, Ryudo, you can just do purple lightning on her. Strike! Purple lightning! And a slice! And that. And that. Nice. Ryudo, get her! Get her, boy! Ha! He says. Um, you can just do fast dance whirl, I guess. Roan, you might as well fix your shit, dude. Here goes! Here goes! Thirty-one, thirty-six, not bad. All is one. Noise. Is she just gonna try to go combo freaking Roan again? Tio, let's have you use. Um, hold on. These are all just one friend, huh? It was just the nut of light that was everybody. Oh well. Um, let's go ahead and heal. 
108 MP for you. Just kind of keep popping off on her. Guts up. This fake millennia is not that strong. She's a weak ass millennia, honestly. And a zappy zap zap. Come, Thunder. Shake the heavens. Shake it, the heavens. Ooh, 4654. Strike! Purple lightning! Take that. Slice them. And slice them. It feels kind of wrong killing Millennia here, but also. You kind of gotta just kill Millennia here, you know? Please, take this. She says to herself. Ron, let's let you do some damage here. Ooh, he might even get the killer the if he can do a lot. True dragon rise. Oh, I think he did it. Good job, Ron. She dropped a bow. Interesting. I mean, I guess what else would Millennia drop? It's just kind of insulting. Thanks, developers. That was rude. Hell yeah, we did. Black Angel Bow. Okay. That's more skill coins. Hmm. Yes. That was just an illusion. Elena. Then where is Millennia? I am afraid no more. My mind is no longer troubled. I can believe. Millennia and I are one. She makes me who I am. Awaken, Millennia. Millennia! <gasps> Miss Millennia! Millennia! Couldn't this idiot woman notice sooner? Anyone could see through that parlor trick. But it's okay now. <laughs> okay. We're together now, right? I guess so. Kid, how you been? Fine, Miss Millennia. And you've made it this far, Miss Marionette. Yes, I believe in the human heart, just as you do. This cannot be. How can you still live? The will of God is absolute. The will of man could never overpower a god. The only thing here that's absolute is your total lunacy. I am right here in all my glory. Bolster your soul and you will not fail. Yes, it is exactly as you taught us. Got it, Valmar? No, Zara. Why did the day of darkness come to pass? Why did Granus die? Was it not because of darkness in the soul of man? If Granus is dead and Valmar is destroyed, there would be nothing to lead man. Is that what you really want? If there is no need for gods, then there is also no need for man as well. Without man, there is no need for the world. What's going on? You go after Zara! Ryudo, that Zara wants to destroy the entire planet! We gotta stop that loon! I believe in you! Take care of Zara! Sure, leave it to us. Just hang in there. And now, for the first time ever, you have these three in a party. Isn't that weird? Alright, so Black Angel Bow, let's go. Let's go ahead and give you the Valkyrie dress. Let's give you that sage's hat. Let's give you hmm, the elf king's boots. A mana insignia. And hmm, I guess I'm just going to have her kind of take over Tio's spot and go icy. That's what I'm thinking. She has the mistake, right? Yeah. Okay, cool. This is why I wanted you to save your skill coins as well. Because look, 
Millennia's got some stuff. So Heal Crush, I just wanted to get it to show it off, but I never really used that. Um, I really want to get Grudging Claws as a strong one. Spellbinding Eyes, nice. Fallen Wings is good for like an AOE, actually. Let's go ahead and do that. Starving Tongue is all right. Let's get another one for Grudging Claws. To... Okay, there we go. I feel pretty good about that. And then, oh yeah, I should have spent more on her arrow shot so she could cancel whenever she wanted, but I didn't, so... There you go. As far as the dragon egg on Elena, hmm. I mean, I don't really need anything else. Well, no, I don't really need anything else. Does the mist egg need anything else? Anything that I could do to make you better, Millennia? Nah. Healer plus up, I guess. And then the book of the sages. Let's get this next. Alright, and then as far as skills, Millennia, let's get you set up with the T.O. Um, set up, so you need some life for sure. You need the Glacier Chant. We'll take... No, not Absorb Magic. We'll take the Storm Cloud. No. North Wind. There we go. We'll take... Come on. Magic Power. We'll take... Mentality. We'll take... Um, the Mystic Chant, too. Yeah. And then we'll power up Mystic Chant, actually. Oh, I have no more points. Well, I should have powered up Mystic Chant, is what I meant to say. Hmm. Oh, well. Here we go. To the final battle. All right. Not gonna lie to you. I know that was a weird fucking cut, but this is my third time doing this, and it's not anything leading up until the final boss, it's just the final boss himself, and this is like the last save point of the game. So I kind of want to just go over what I did to switch it up. So Ryudo, I gave life up, strength, strength, special power, move, recover, and dash. Um, for Elena, I gave her life up, life up, decoy, special power, mentality, and magic power. For Millennia, I gave her intelligence, magic power, zap fire chance, intelligence, life up, and wizardry chant. And equipping-wise, I kind of made Elena my tank, because Millennia's magic is a lot higher than hers, even without any of the skills or anything equipped. So I kind of did that. My plan is, Elena will be the tank. Ryudo and Millennia will just put out as much power as they can. I also equipped, as you can see, Elena with the fairy egg, so she's going to be kind of my assistance type person and I gave the dragon egg to Millennia herself and I just kind of kept Ryota with the holy egg because his magic doesn't matter as much. So just to kind of give you my equipment going into this, um, hopefully this is the last time I try to record this because the final boss is a dick. Now up until the final boss, we are actually going to be having like a small little bit boss gauntlet and this part in and of itself is not too bad. Um, so we want to start off with our good friend from the very beginning of the game, Valmar's Tongue. That's right, he's back. We're pretty much going to fight like all the pieces of Valmar. Well, not all of them, but most of the pieces of Valmar right before we fight the final boss. Which is fine, we have plenty of items and all that stuff to kind of handle that, so that's fine. Now, the reason that I made Elena the tank as well is because she has White Apocalypse, which is a pretty strong move and is still going to be able to do damage to everyone involved. Let's go ahead and hit him with the Sky Dragon Slash as well. We're just trying to do mucho damage to pretty much all of the bosses up until the final boss. Just crush him with damage, and we should be okay. But yeah, like I said, I know that's a weird cut. This is still going to be the finale episode. It's just been like... Eh, three days. <laughs> I try this like once every day, and then after that, I'm like kind of pissed. You know what I mean? Sworn Understandably enemies, so. You shall be defeated. Because Take I mean, at, at some point, Grandia to hard mode was going to give us difficulty, right? The final boss is the perfect time to do it. It's not that I'm mad at that at all. I'm just mad that I'm getting my ass kicked. <laughs> I mean, if we're being honest here. So, with that being said. Let's see what Millennia can do with a baboom on these fools. But yeah, Elena has decoy too, so hopefully they're all coming. Look, Elena only took 151 from that. I kind of made her into a magic tank, because the final boss uses a shit ton of magic. And so that's how it goes down. I also got frustrated right before this too. Because my freaking dog, I've talked about this in, I think, maybe like that last episode. I might have even talked about it at the beginning of this video because it's been so many days. But 
she has this thing where the neighbor dog she tries to like fight against the fence or whatever. Normal dog shit. But she gets so distracted by that that she won't poop because she gets in trouble for trying to fight with them. I'm like, leave them alone, you fucking bitch. It's not just her though. I mean, the dogs on the other side are kind of dicks too. So they're all like barking at each other. It's whatever. The dog politics. I put up a like a chicken wire fence, and I, I've done certain things to try to make them stop it, um, but they're just not stopping it, so that's annoying. Um, but anyways, she gets so distracted by them, and then she gets in trouble that she forgets to poop, so I even had her out there for a minute, and I'm like, poop. <laughs> you know what I mean? Poop. And she didn't do it, and I was like, fine, I'm not going to make you stand out here. It's a rainy day today, too, and we're all raining and shit, so I'm like, I'm not going to make you stand out here in the rain if you're not going to poop. Ooh, gluttony. I don't know if I ever actually saw this animation even the first time we fought it but gross uh did a lot of damage too actually so then millennia will have you do your thing but boom did it seem like the best let's try to, try to gad zap the main body see how much we do oh shit that was instant too maybe i need to spend some more coins into baboom Food's so hot, but I might. But anyways, so dog gets distracted because she gets in trouble, right? So then she came back inside. We chilled for like a little bit, and I swear to God, like I was literally just playing with the dog and the cat because I like I like to roughhouse them. I'm just gonna do one apocalypse here and end it. But um, I like to roughhouse with them, and I get like under the blanket and I pet them and do stuff like that. That's just like our game. That's what we do. This bitch, I do that. I had them both under the blanket. We're like playing and all that stuff, and then I'm done. And I get up, and then she keeps coming up to me like like she wants attention. Usually when she has to go potty, she'll like bark at me or talk to me or say something. Oh, that didn't do shit. Can this finish it off? 26, 64? I don't know. Let's try Purple Lightning instead. Um, purple lightning. So we were just doing that, right? We were just playing together and doing all that shit. And then she comes up, acts like she wants just attention, not like she had to go out. She didn't say anything, you know what I mean? She just kind of like kept sticking her nose in my face trying to get pets and so i was like no no i'm busy right now as you guys have seen me do on stream often and then this motherfucker i turned for a second start working on some stuff and she i smell shit and i'm like oh my god and i turn around she shits in my office big shit too now just like oh she couldn't hold it it was a little dollop it was like a whole shit and a lot of it i was so pissed and so we just had that argument before this by the way that was valmar's tongue not too bad So yeah, <laughs> that's how my morning's been. We just got the Starlight Tiara, which cuts MP consumption. That's going to go straight to um, Millennium. And then we're going to go ahead and use items to kind of fill out whatever we can. Elena actually proved to be a very useful tank during that one. So I'm hoping that kind of carries over into the final boss fight that I've been warning you guys about. Let's go ahead. Oh, that's MP. Let's go ahead and use some Bao Babs, mainly for Ryudo. Because I did give Ryudo the King's Pride to up the power of his moves instead of giving him the SP consumption like cut. So I'm hoping that that doesn't really bite me in the ass during the final battle too. I'm expecting that we might have to use an item on him to restore his MP consumption, but I'm not sure. Now, out of all of the re-fights that we're doing with Valmar, I would say that this one is the hardest. I think this Valmar piece was the hardest originally anyway. But yes, as you guys can tell, it's the Eye of Elmar just popping up out of nowhere for no reason. Loud ass motherfuckers. They really are. Okay, Elena, um... I really doubt they're susceptible to that. Let's just go all out on this one, too. I don't have too much trouble with these guys too much. It's just the final boss that I've been having trouble on. This boss gauntlet, it's fine. It's the same pieces of Elmar. But, uh, they're just harder. I guess one thing to kind of know about Valmar's eye here is that the eyeballs are actually, like, as strong as the main body here. So you can't just kind of, like, cut them out like we would in the first one. But he's also not going to revive them. At least, actually, I mean, he's never had the chance to revive them because I killed the main body around the same time that I killed the eyes. But, just something to kind of take note of, I guess. Good way to put it. There you go. That was decent damage. Millennia, let's have you do a gad zap on the main body and see how much that does. Because I'm curious, because as soon as you kill the main body, everything's dead, but I don't mind doing all the AoEs too, because everything here has quite a lot of HP, so it's like, it's worth it. But yeah, if I was going to say any other boss fight were to give me trouble other than the final boss, it would be this one. 
But this isn't too bad, actually, in all reality. Oh, shit! Millennia! Out here, doing the damages. That's kind of hoping what our strat will be for the final boss fight. Because I have a new series. Not that I don't love Grandia 2, but, like, we're at the end of the cycle here. And I have a new series I'm excited to do soon. And they're they're denying me, goddammit. Elena's getting fucking bullied right now. Um... How much... You still have questionable health. Um, let's just do a healer plus on Elena. I know I'm missing out on some damage there, Ryudo, and you'll be upset, but I think it's better for us overall. Let's go ahead and hit him with a baboom to kind of slow some of them down if we can. I don't mind that you're using speedy, and we will continue the damage output here soon, but Elena's getting... <sighs> she just got killed, actually. Dumb bitch. Well, then what? Is that Healer Plus just a waste of a turn at this point? Elena, God damn it! This Frankly, I'm not paying that much enough. attention right now during this fight either, which is stupid. I'm kind of, I'm doing other things. It's because, like I said, this is like the third time I've tried to record this part. So, I'm like, meh. As far as they're concerned, meh to all of them. Well, hopefully, Ryudo and Millennia can survive until we can get Elena back on her feet. I'll save you! What a waste. I wish I could have let just taken that back. Or Ryudo could have been a little bit faster, but it is what it is. It's the Delta Burst, dude. That's what gets you. See that? Oh, and it paralyzed him. God fucking damn it, dude. So now we're just hoping Elena can I'm uh, Elena Millennia can get there. If they do their regular attacks and shit like that, it's not that bad. Um Where is it? Yomi's elixir, because I don't I wanna save that hero's elixir, so yeah, Yomi's elixir on her, please. For the love of fuck. So Elena's back at least. Here you go. But Millennia and Ryudo might die. Is this gonna be a close battle for no reason? Is my new setup shit? Is that what you're trying to tell me? Because I don't like that. <laughs> I'm not a fan of that at all. Alright, Elena, you're back. Ryudo's paralyzed. All in spew. Oh, that wasn't that bad. I'm sure that could do an arrangement of fucking stuff to you, though. Now you're gonna kill Millennia. Great. Girl. Unnecessary, honestly. And Ryudo's paralyzed, so I pretty much just have one... one person. Oh my god, if they're shitty got Ryudo, too. For why? Oh. Girl. I swear to God. This is a joke. I've literally killed this thing so easily all the other times. Maybe my new setup is shit. I don't know. Let's see. Everything's coming for Elena. I literally think the only chance here is to defend. And let Ryudo come back and try to do his thing. Alright, Ryudo. Um... Let's just do this. For now. God, she's getting hit. Luckily, I had her defend. I mean, shit, I don't... Don't know what else I'm supposed to do there. This will heal us a little bit. You're using runner again. Whatever, bud. I mean, fuck you, though. It's, it's working out quite well for you. Alright, alright, alright. What the fuck? They're shitting on us. This is ridiculous. Seed of Poison Runner. Hmm. Let's have you do Droplets of Life. I don't know if that revives Millennia. I would assume no. But it'll at least heal us and then we can maybe get Millennia back. And then turn the shit around. I told you this fight was easy, and now I'm losing it. Let's let's focus up real quick. Ugh, this is kind of hard because I want to see if either way we'll be fully healed up. So I guess it's fine. Valmar's eye only has seven thousand left. So let's do Sky Dragon Slash just to slow all of their AP while we do this. Now, if this heals Millennia, that's going to be game changer, and it's actually re really good to know. 
but I don't think that this also revives because it doesn't heal status effects. But I think it will actually just heal Elena and Ryudo. They go rain on me. Oh, it Small does revive enemies, Millennia. That is defeated. huge to know. Okay, we'll carry that into the final boss fight then. There you go. We're turning this shit around. Fuck you. Now I got all three of them. I just did a sky. Ooh, that was like 6,000 damage too. You almost killed the main body there. We're close. We just got to survive one more round of their bullshit, and then I'll have Millennia Gad zap it, and it's fine. Yes, yes. You've got to run her. Yeah, I really kind of fucked up here. Next time, we'll do better, okay? As far as, like, the final boss fight. You motherfucker. You should be dead after this. And then, if the eyeball bats are still around, that would be kind of stupid and annoying. But we can handle them, okay? But just getting the main body out of here is huge. Can't believe that was giving me trouble. Now I'm kind of worried about this as my setup for the final boss. But I really thought that this was better to have Elena kind of run as a tank. Oh, good. See, that killed everything. Fuck all of you. You're all dead to me. Oh, that was annoying. Good job, Millennium. Good job to Elena, honestly. That was the biggest shout out of that battle. Alright, let's heal ourselves up. That was some shit we just experienced. So you can do all healer on everybody. Good. And then let's go ahead and look at, like... These Lumiere flowers. Let's see. You can use it for sure. Actually, let's just give you... Whoa, whoa, whoa. Let's move you up to Grail Fruits. You deserve it. And then top you off there. You need some too. Hmm. Let's do that for you and you're good. Then as far as Baobabs. Ryoto needs them. You need them. You need them. Okay. Everyone is pretty much fully hit. Ryoto, I don't care about your MP right now. Um, That's good. Let's go ahead and dump these special coins that I have into some stuff. Starving Tongue's good. Still Biting Eyes the best. More Starving Tongue. I want your cancel all the way up there. Heal Crush. Sure. Nightmare Ball. Sure. I mean, what else am I going to use at this point? And then as far as magic goes... I don't know if there's anything necessarily I want to give to you. This one's pretty much all the way up, but I guess I would like to get cold all the way up because I'll be using that on the final boss I think and then I guess runner would be nice too oh actually no I think I want speedy is what I'm looking for and then as far as like books I don't know I guess I could pump up this mentality that I gave Elena and the mystic chant that's not really going to benefit me now. I guess I'll show you those. That was Leaf Water Chant and that. I guess. I guess. Well, huh. We're running out of things to dump stuff into, which is low-key a good thing. Do you guys recognize this nasty little thing? That's right, we're fighting the Heart of Valmar fish again. Um, with Elena, we'll just pop right off here. I'm pretty sure, yeah, Dragon Zap can hit all of them. So let's just open with Dragon Zap on them for the most part. Uh -uh. Look, but don't touch. La la. Alright. Um, Ryuta will have you Sky Dragon Slash again. This one, in my opinion, is much easier than the eye. Watch me fuck get fucked up now that I said that. But Sworn I really do think that this one is easier than the eye. Defeated. Take that. So uh, we'll, we'll just hope we can do it. I'm, st 
still I'm still doing some things. It's just like here's the thing, and this is my one complaint about Grandia 2, to be honest with you. I, I love this game. Don't get me wrong. Don't try to take me out of context. I fucking love this game. But it's like, damn, these animations are too long. And times were different then, because like I said the same thing about Final Fantasy X, right? That I felt like the summon animations and stuff were too long, even the shortened versions. But back then, that was like the big thing. And like, especially like, this game was originally released on the Dreamcast. So it's like, um, what was I trying to say? Sorry, I read a message. Yeah, this was originally on the Dreamcast. So like, the fact that these animations were so cool and so epic and so big was kind of like the big selling point. I would assume during that time so it's like I get it but for us now in current day I'm like bitch stop it <laughs> you know what I mean like just stop I'm over these animations but times have changed the story of this game is great it's not anything like that but that's why I'm kind of like half here half not here when doing these fights again because I'm like girl I already did this you know just go ahead and just drag and zap them again but don't touch you could look at Millennia, but you can't touch her. Oh, shit. Well, my dumbass, this is what you get for not paying attention. I didn't realize it was immune to that. I think this thing was immune to crackling last time I tried to fight it, too, so I think it might just be immune to all magic. So don't quote me on that, but I think so. So we'll just have Ryudo keep popping off here, and then we can have Sword Millennia do her Valmar moves. It's not like her Valmar defeated. moves are bad by any means. Uh, she's just such a strong magic person that, you know. Speedy! Yes. gonna do the aorta thing oh black fog spew ew i didn't even know that was a thing and it gave him plague that's shitty just gonna do freeze and wow let's go ahead and give a halva to damn that hit millennia too let's give it to ryudo i don't even know this thing could cast plague see there you go well because the thing is is my old party that i was trying to do this with as you guys have seen um it was mainly just like all offense like go 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 push 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 but for the final boss i was like we gotta have some sort of tanky thing, because I don't have Roan, there's only the three of us. Like, we have to do something different. So this is me doing something different. I think it does kind of make these battles slightly more challenging, because it's not like I'm just ripping through them like I was. Um, but I think it'll be better overall. You're gonna do that black fog spew again? Bro. Honestly, just no. Ten say can slash. Access denied. Nice. And then here's one cool thing you can do with... Oh, dang it. Whatever. Fuck you, dude. Here's one cool thing you can do with Millennia is the Starving Tongue. Because she needs healed. This will heal her. So, there you go. Damn, they're really coming out here with the sta status abnormalities, eh? But yeah, this will heal up Millennia a little bit and then we'll be good. Yes, eat them, queen. And then she gets like a ridiculous amount of HP back. I wish that, it's pretty much a full heal. I wish that uh, I could spread that out to everyone. But honestly, the biggest thing for me is that droplets of life from Elena uh, fucking revives. That's huge. And especially since I made her my tank, that's even bigger. Ryudo, you took the biggest hit from that. Sorry. Ryudo's slightly in danger. Slightly. Heal, you can heal all you want, bud. Alright, Ryudo, we pretty much just need to finish the main body, so let's purple lightning that son of a bitch. Strike! Purple lightning! And then we'll see how much is left over, if anything, and I'll have Elena impact bomb him, or maybe even white Take apocalypse, that. depending on how and much that. is left. Yeah. Get him, Ryudo, slice those bitches. Not quite dead, but. Oh, that actually didn't do that much damage at all. Let's go ahead and do. I am the conflict. I'm gonna do droplets of life just to make sure that Ryudo can get to the oh, end here and then he can kill send it. Your rain of life. 
This battle too, though, I've been distracted. I'm doing some things. Sorry, I'm like, in real time right now, I'm like reworking my Discord a lot. So I'm like trying to work on that while recording, which maybe isn't the smartest thing. Not even that I'm trying to work on that. I just did some changes and did some things, and now people are messaging me, and so I'm like kind of trying to read their messages because obviously I care about their opinion and what they have to say. But I'm also recording. I don't know. So I'm not like responding. I don't know. It's stupid. I should probably just like not have my phone there. You know what I mean? But whatever. Let's go with Stry Sky Dragon Slash. That seems to do a lot of damage. You know, and it hits all parts. If we can at least eliminate like an eye or something, like, we'll be chilling. We were already chilling. This battle's not that hard. Um, especially compared to the eyeball, right? Oh, that ended it. The eyeball is way harder, in my opinion. Wonderful! And you're done. Practice if you want to beat me. There you go, Ryudo. And then we got Tenma's dress. That's a cool little item. Let me show you. And then we'll heal too. And then it's final boss time. Um, I'm going to give Tenma's dress to you because it does have level 2 on all attack resistance. And I already have you with the all status disorder resistance, which is pretty much what I want. So Elena will not be compromised at any point, which is what I'm looking for. She's like the main healer right now. Let's go ahead and use this to kind of heal everybody up. It's not like I was going to use these wound salves for anything else ever. Let's go ahead and go down to our Bow Babs. Heal everybody up. Now, as far as SP for Ryudo in battle, I have the golden potions. That should be plenty. As far as MP goes, nobody really used that much MP this last battle. Except for maybe Millennia, but I just finished her off. So, we should be good there as far as, like, final last little points. Um... I do think for well, Flying Tensei can actually cast more. Let's get it maxed just in case. Maybe that's something I want to be using on him. I'm not sure. And the Nightmare Ball, almost maxed. Not sure what else I would do there. As far as magic, I don't know. Sure, let's get Stram and Freeze up. This thing literally doesn't... Let's just fully max out this egg. There you go. We can up Quake too. Not that I'll ever use it. Might as well learn Howlnado. Not that I'll ever use it, but... Yeah, there you go. Oh, foolish, piteous humans, accept your fate, accept the mercy of a perfect god, ashes to ashes, dust to dust. <laughs> you really are completely nuts. Woo! You better reel yourself in, you psycho! Why not try to understand the human heart? Your heart is suffering because you do not understand it. Meaningless human love. I don't care to know about love. But you still have a human heart, Zara. Look at you. You're shaking with fear. There is no way that you could be a god. Petrified humans like you cannot rule divinity. I am not some human named Zara. I am God! I am the one and only absolute God, Valma! You impudent humans, I shall show you my divine power! Yes, the final boss is no one but Zara himself, and in fact, he is... Fucking moth. <laughs> Here's the thing is like this battle. Oh. Sorry, I forgot I turned it up for the voice acting, so hopefully the music didn't drown me out there. But yeah, he's a fucking moth. Um you're gonna use Gad Zap on her. That's shitty, but honestly it's kind of okay. Let's use Flying Tensei Can. Ooh! We might even cancel him. 
Yeah, that's right, bitch. Sky can just run up and pick up the final boss and just yeet him. Here goes flying Tensei Ken. Ooh, that was 5627. That's pretty good. Didn't cancel, but good. Now, Gad's up. At least that's only targeting one person, and it's Elena. The thing is, is like, I have it set. This guy mainly uses magic. Um, and I have it says that she's pretty resistant to magic, so I'm interested to see how much this Gads app does, because it's going to affect my decisions moving forward. 966, still pretty good, but he's not going to paralyze her because of the priestess rope, so that's good. Millennia, with you, girl, I'm just going to have you just start off with the Gads app as well. Let's hit him back just as hard. So Ryudo did 5627, I believe. And Melina's gonna do what? Cause like if I can do like about 10,000 every time they have a turn, I might be okay. 50, okay cool. So that's good. Now with you, Elena, I really want you to use cold. Because this man moves too quickly. And so we need to try to kind of slow him down a little bit. Act minus two, nice. And then he uses crackle as well, which is like, Shitty, but whatever. That did 424, so she can take a couple rounds of shit. She has lots of life up, she's got the resistance and stuff, so it should be fine. He's gonna use Crackle again, that's fine. Let's do another Flying Tensei Can right after that. Because pretty much what I'm predicting, and it may or may not be true, but I'm predicting that I gotta heal Elena probably like every other turn. And then Sky in between, I can have her kind of trying to buff people. We'll see if that works or not. I'm not sure if this guy has Vanish or not either, but Here goes we definitely just want to be on the Ken. upside of all the buffs. I can keep going. Breath of God. I think this one hurts actually kind of hard. Oh no, that's his buffer. I forgot about that. Now what are you doing? Gad zap on her again. That's going to suck, but... She's just going to have to take it, to be honest with you. Let's see how much Grudging Claws can do to him. Ooh, and we got it off first. Good for us. Mm, fresh ground hamburger. Ew, I hate when she says that. That's like the grossest <laughs> line of the game. Fresh ground hamburger. You nasty bitch. Squeeze it. Squeeze it real good. Nice. Uh, about the same as her gad's out. So, nothing crazy, but it's there. Alright, Gad zapping her. Honestly, this is already going better than my last couple runs of this guy, so hopefully we can pull this out here. Also, it's creepy how his face comes out of the moth. I know that for sure. These. It's gonna freak some people out. Um, Ryudo. I think let's just keep the flying Tensei can up. For a while, because I think Elena can probably heal herself. Sky, take flight. And if I'm wrong, then she's dead, and I'll revive her with something. But I just think that will be okay. Here hopefully. goes flying Tensei Ken. And yeet. We've got about a quarter of his health done so far, so that's good. He's probably gonna baboom. Oh shit. Oh, that's not good. I didn't know he had baboom. Baboom's what ended our game. That one time. Oh, that's gonna suck. Oh, that's really gonna suck if that's the case. Oh, that wasn't that bad, though. I mean, it sucked, but it wasn't that bad. So let's go ahead and use Droplets of Life. That'll heal everybody. Oh, holy ones. Send your rain of life. I was scared. I really thought it was game over there. When I saw him using Baboom, I was like, bitch. Hell yeah. Breath of God, that's his buffer. Which is annoying. We need to get to a point where we can get his act back down. Because look how fast he's moving without that shit. If he's going to gad zap her, that's fine. That's kind of what he does. Right, and so Elena can take it for a little bit, but then we need to get to a point where we can start lowering his stats too. Actually, I have an idea, maybe. I don't know if it's worth it or not, but we'll, we'll try it. 
Remember all those items I've been holding on to? Maybe that's something that I could use. See, that's only 949, that's good. Let's see here. Um, oh, that's 2,000 damage and that's nice, not bad. But I wanted like... So that's minus one on all for him. That's interesting. That's minus one defense. Minus two defense, ooh. Okay. Let's do the plus five act level to Elena herself. Sky, Since she's like the points. healer, I want her moving quick. So we'll do that. I might actually end up having them do that to everybody. Here and goes. then I'll have Nine, Elena ten keep ten. slowing him down. I'd like to get like WoW and stuff off on Ryudo at some point too, but it's kind of hard. Here you go. That'll help you out, Elena. Hopefully you're moving quick after that shit. Yeah, she's moving faster. She's just the healer, you know what I mean? I want the healer moving quick so I can heal when I need to heal, you know? That's just how I personally feel about it. All things must obey me! Gad zap again. The thing is, is he's going to keep using that, but since Elena can't get paralyzed, that was my biggest issue with the last couple battles I was fighting him with, is he kept paralyzing everybody, and I was like, fuck. I also didn't have decoy on anybody, I didn't have like a set tank, so he would like hit everybody, paralyze like two of them, and then just murder the other one, and I was pretty much fucked as he'd slowly murder the last and final party member. That sucked. Um, so I don't want to do that again. Let's go ahead and keep these flying Tensei Kens coming out. Just popping off. Rito has plenty Sky, of SP to kind of support Flying Tensei Ken for a while, and then eventually I'll have somebody use a Golden Potion on him and re-up on it. But for right now, I feel pretty okay. Here goes Flying Tensei Ken. Yeet. Nice. 5697. We're still slowly wearing away at him. We're playing the long game here. Now, Elena, I want you to use Healer Plus on yourself, girl. Millennia. It might be worth it to do the Demon Ash on him. Lower everything. One. Doesn't seem like a bad plan. Poison. You're going to hit Elena. So hopefully Elena's far enough from everybody else that it just hits her. If Millennia gets hit by it and gets poisoned, that sucks. Oh, it does look like Millennia is going to get hit by it. That sucks, but it's not like horrible. We can cure it at some point. Poison's not as bad as Plague, obviously. If Plague was here, that would be worse. But Millennia getting in the crossfire, oh well, you know. Demon Ash, Here that boy. And that makes his act go down too, which is huge. Elena is healed. Poison again. Listen, you already did that, and you're not going to be able to poison Elena. She's immune to all status normal abnormalities. You fuck. Oh. oh my god. All things must obey me. Do they though? Must they? I don't know about all that. Alright, sir, what are you trying to do? Oh, ba boom again? I'd really like it if you didn't do that actually. But I guess he's going to. So that just means I'll have Elena do droplets Sky, of life flight. next. Lit slice that hoe. Here goes flying ten say Ken. Nice. All right, we're still we're chipping away. Yeah, ba boom. That just means you drop one slice. Nothing. nothing at all. Fuck you! I really thought this was gonna end my game when you did this the first time. Definitely gonna need droplets of life because Millennia is like dying. Breath of God, that's annoying, but whatever. At least we just used the Demon Ash on him last time, so it's slightly weaker. The big thing is his act. I need to keep that act level down. Oh, holy ones, send your rain of I wish this would cure poison too. If it revives people, 
but it can't cure poison. Like that seems silly. Rain on us, Elena. Mainly for millennia's sake. Oh, it does cure poison. I thought it didn't for some reason. Gad zap on her. That's fine. Let's have you. Let's use the Platinum Feather. I said I was never going to use those, but I think that raises the act of everybody. So, like, this is the time to use them. And it hits everybody, not just some. So this should be good, question mark. Hopefully this helps. We get it, bro. You gad zap You like gad zapping. We get it. Fuck off. Alright, flying can take in again. Sky, take flight! We're getting to the point where I need to have somebody start using golden potions. I might switch over to like Millennia doing Gad Zap and then have Brigido heal himself. That might be the best way to do it. So then we still have damage coming out. Here you go. Oh, it just like moves us across that. That's not what I was expecting. But cool, I guess. Um, so then I can have you. Let's just do cold on him because we know we need to slow him down a little bit more. Oh, then that platinum feather is not really that great. That's kind of shitty, actually. I mean, I guess I could see some very specific circumstances where that might be useful, but like, I shall no, I need like actual you. buffs right now. Ouchies for Elena. Sucks to suck. It happens. Um, Ryudo. Get another flying ten second off on this bastard. Sky, take flight. And luckily, Elena's like regaining HP, like slowly. She's got some regen effects on her, so that's cool. Here goes. This is gonna be a long finale. Ken. Maybe I'll split it up into two parts. I'm not sure. Slow oh, the fuck down, sir. Glacier. You are too fast. Yes. Slow that down for us, please. Ba boom again. Okay. So Elena's going to need to use the Droplets of Life soon. Which means I should probably start healing SP. That's what I'm thinking. So if I start with Ryudo, because she has one more Droplets of Life in her, which is fine. Because that'll get us through now. So if I heal Ryudo now, I can heal Elena on the next go around. As far as SP is concerned, you know. What are you trying to do right now? Gad zap on Elena. That's annoying, but bound to happen. So let's have you. Yeah, let's have to act out that plan. Let's have you gad zap, and then I'll have Ryudo heal himself with SP, and then we'll start healing Elena with SP. So fuck it yourself. Imagine if he got paralyzed. That'd be sick. Nice. Okay, so we're over halfway done with him too. Something to note. Do you guys like the Gad Zap animation? Because you've seen it like 50 times already. And it's gonna keep happening. Get used to it. I shall smite you! Ooh, that one did. Okay, he's actually starting to do more to Elena than he's supposed to. And he's already decided he's gonna Gad Zap her again. Um. Well, actually, she might be okay with her. No, Ryudo, you need to do your job. If only there was one for, like, everybody. You know what I mean? There's just one friend. All of them are just one friend. Unfortunate. Um, yeah, Ryudo, use your golden potion on you, dude. Oh, Crackle, she can handle that. Then let's get a drop of some life off. Crackle's not nearly as strong as Gad Zap, obviously. Yeah, only 436, and she should be able to get her droplets of life off soon. I know it takes her a minute to, like, re, re get on her shit, but she should be able to do it. Go, girl. Oh, she didn't even move. What the fuck? She should be able to survive poison, too, but she needs to get going. Shit! 
I'm dying. Respectfully, Elena, your life actually depends on it. So if you could just like get moving. She takes so long to be like, oh, I'm hurt. You know what I mean? Oh no, they're gonna kill her. Fuck you, dude. This is not good. He just moves so fast, and Elena takes so long to be like, oh, I'm hurt. <laughs> like, stop. Just go. Alright, that sucks. But here's the plan. Alright, Millennia, come on. I know, Elena. It's because you sat there for too long, girl. My bad. I guess I should have been a little bit more conservative with the healing. So, Ryudo, we're going to have you do the Heroes Elixir to Elena. And then you can just do, like, Gad Zap just to slow him down a little bit. Because as soon as Elena's back, he's going to start hitting her again, and she's going to be all buffed up, so it's fine. I just need a, just an extra little second here to let Ryudo get that off. Oh my god, dude. He's ridiculous, actually. I don't know, can you survive a crackle, Millennia? No, the answer to that is nor. Damn it. Stupid, stupid, stupid. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Finally, Ryudo, fuck. <laughs> so if Elena's back, the thing is, is even if Ryudo dies, Elena can use droplets of life and everything's okay again. And she's all buffed up. So hopefully we can get that off. Because you're probably... Oh, you switched that to Elena that quick, dude? That's kind of weird of you, but okay. Thing is, is she's going to be able to take a bunch of hits. Even Gad Zaps or something. It's only going to take her 10 years to get there, but she'll do it eventually. What are you trying to do? Gad Zap her? Honestly, no. <laughs> We're just going to stop that, because she needs the time to move across the board, okay? Sir, fuck off. Let her go just a little bit more. Poison on her, that's fine. Drop with some life, let's go. This got a little close, but we can do it. Do not... All right, Elena, here's the thing is you can't sit there for 10 years going, oh, he hit me. I mean, you do have more time. Oh, there you go. See, why didn't you move that fast the first time? Oh, holy ones. This gets Send Elena back. Now we need to heal. Life. I mean, this gets Millennia back, but we need to heal Elena. There we go. So Millennia's back up. Oh, fuck you, dude. You are nothing. You gonna use the boom right now? Blow it up. Whatever, that actually wasn't that bad overall. Ryudo. I still want the damage going out here, so you go ahead and do your flying tempest again. I'll have Millennia heal Elena's SP when she can. Because Ryudo's just doing solid here goes, damage here consistently. So. Ken. Let's keep that up. There we go. We're moving again. He's only got like a quarter left, so if we can get our shit together. He's using Breath of God a lot, though. That's annoying. Trying to get his act up to normal. Ugh, and he's being successful, the worst. You are nothing. Nothing he's starting to use Baboom a lot more, too. Have you noticed that? He's trying to hit everybody. He's trying to really end me. Which honestly is fine as long as Elena lives, because she can use Droplets of Life, but she needs the SP to be able to do that. It's a whole six cycle here. But actually what he's doing the most here is slowing all of our IP a little bit for our injury phase. Alright, you need to get this golden potion off now, yesterday. On Elena. 
What are you trying to do, sir? Breath of God again? Yeah, if you could just stop, that'd be cooler. Let's cool you down a little bit. All things must obey me. No, they don't have to obey you, dude. Cold to glacier. Yeah, slow that shit down. You're being too much. And actually, just to be safe here, um, we're gonna do this potion of Azure just for here good go. measure. Because I think he's trying to baboom everybody to death here. And I'm just not gonna have it. I'm not gonna wait for Lena to get back and do droplets of life. I think that's gonna be too long. And as I learned with the last couple of deaths, we need to be a little bit more defensive here. So Ryudo, heal everybody. I can't keep going. Now I feel more comfortable. Boom. Felt great. Now we can survive another baboom if I had to. Hopefully I don't ever have to, but I could. And yeah, hit Elena with Crackle, whatever you want, that's fine. That's kind of what that's for. Breath of God again, I hate you. I wish we had that move. Alright, let's just start popping off here. I think we're close enough that it's like, we could kill him. We we can kill him. He's close. Get him, Millennia. Because the biggest thing is we have to keep the damage pumping out here. We just have to. Otherwise, it ain't gonna work. Look, but don't touch. Look, but don't touch. Nice. Gadzap, that's fine, honestly. Let's just get another flying Tensei Ken out here. Because, yeah, if everybody else's HP is fine, then we can just have Elena do, like, healer or something on herself, and she'll be fine. Well, no, everybody's slightly down, so I guess we could just use Droplets of Life and be safe. I went ahead and gave her all the SP. It's not like she's going to run out now. Just to like fully heal everybody, and he's gonna keep going for her, so she'll be kind of low HP by then. Sky, take flight! I'm assuming. Get her. Fuck you, Valmar. In the original version of this game, this guy is like a cakewalk. It's hella easy. In this version of the game, they did really buff his ass up, which is fine. I get it. Yeah, you're gonna gas up her again. That's fine. Let's just get droplets of life off. Oh shit! He went faster than her. Everybody's healed now. Like, Elena can take as many hits as you need her to at this point. So, yeah. Another Gadzap animation. We love it. Yeah, at some point you just have to, like, disassociate from all the animations. I will admit, though, this battle's pretty fucking all epic. Especially because it's been, like, difficult and that we're, we're going back and forth here really fighting to the death. It, it's pretty epic. Yeah, yeah, hit her with another thing. Poison, bro, she's not gonna get poison. That's the thing is, I planned for your shit since you did kick my ass, like, three times. <laughs> I planned. I planned for this, I planned for you. Just son of a bitch. Shed thy body. Yeah, yeah, you poisoned millennia again. We'll use droplets of life later and fix it, don't worry. Rito flying tensei can. Sky, take flight! See where we're at after this shit. He should be getting close. Here goes! Flying Tensei Ken! He's getting there. I see it. Oh, yes! He's under 10,000 now. That's huge. Gadzap that motherfucker. He's under 10,000 damage now. So this will do, like, what? Four or 5,000 damage? Then Ryudo can finish him off with the Flying Tensei Ken next turn. Thank God. This guy sucks. Nice. He's got just a sliver left. Kudos to this game for making the final boss actually tough. 
I do appreciate it. It was annoying recording wise for me because like I said, I've had to do this. I did do that boss gauntlet quite a few times now. But kudos to the game overall. I do enjoy a good hard final boss fight. <laughs> Makes you earn it. Now if they wanted to be real dicks, they would have replaced that poison with like a, a plague move. That would have been evil, evil. Shed thy alley, buddy. Alright, um, Elena. Let's just have you, girl. Um. Honestly, yeah. Do that if you want. Rito, finish him off. Sky it's time! Right. Get your ass beat. Flying Tensei Ken! With the help of Sky. I'm so happy to see you die, you stupid butterfly. Damn, I really thought this part was going to be voice acted. Sorry, that's why I was sitting there silent. Mr. Ryudo, you and the others did it! I'm glad. Now the world is saved. We did pretty good too, right, Tio? I am relieved. Now I can die with no regrets. No. You are going to live. I cannot stand it anymore. This cannot be! This is not a fitting end for a god! How was I defeated by such weak and tender-hearted humans? The salvation of the world, the future of mankind, is not to be. How could I, the almighty god, the supreme being, lose? God, Schmod! The only thing you've lost is your memory, you senile fool! Gods don't survive for that long. Oh, whatever. What, what is this? You are no god. You're a pathetic loser who forgot that people share their hearts with each other. They don't throw them away. And why the hell would we need you to save us? Trust, consideration, love. These things make us strong. I've learned how to share my heart with Ryudo and Elena. And everyone. That's why we're standing here and you're not. Everything that you have done has been all for naught. You cheated and betrayed all of the people who trusted you. There's no way that such a man as you could see what is really important is our future, our hearts, the power of good within us. If you couldn't see that our hearts are capable of more than just breeding darkness, you were ever only looking into a mirror. You have already given an up on us from the very beginning, forgetting what truly matters. You could never be a god, much less a man. I did not want this. I did not want to be swallowed by darkness, to be judged on the day of darkness. I was ever afraid. Have I been so wrong? Was it Valmar's moon that led me to this cold, dead place? Or was it always only me? What a pitiful man. Not just a man. Not a man, just a fool. Sorry, I fucked up that line. I don't know why they make the text so friggin' fast in this game. Do you not know I'm doing a let's play? Do you not know why I gotta read it out loud? Fuck.
Did you save me? Yes. I'm sorry. It must have hurt. It must have really hurt. No, it did not hurt at all. It is worse to have a broken heart. I do not want to be sad again. I want to be near people. Um, um, Tio, you're squeezing too tight. Oh, I'm sorry. You won't be sad again. I'll be with you. Oh, I have fond memories like this. So warm. I think someone once held me like this. What's wrong? This is a very strange feeling. Is this heart to heart? I feel so peaceful. Why is this? I am so happy, but... You were only supposed to cry when upset, right? Tio, let's go home. Back to everyone. Yes, let's go home. To where we were born. Granite Cliffs. It's weird how they don't have voice acting here. The world is returning to the way it was. We have won. The world has been made safe. Yes, Valmar has been defeated. But just because Valmar is gone doesn't mean that everything will be made perfect. What do you mean? They have always been suffering even before Valmar came to this world. The Granis Cliffs may be healed, but Valmar has destroyed cities, wounded the land. The world is still plagued with misfortune. The people possessed by Valmar have still not gotten their souls back. The little blind girl, the dead whose bodies were defiled, they haven't found peace yet. Also, there is nothing for people to believe in anymore. I realized that it was wrong to believe just for belief's sake, but having nothing to believe in makes life purposeless. Now that Grandis and Valmar are gone, there are some who will seek to replace them. Others will despair and lose the will to live. I see. Both man and world are torn up inside, left broken inside, eh? So will man continue to fight forever? Has the fate of man not changed at all? Ryudo, mankind needs goals to be content. Everyone must pray and hope for happiness. They must live a proper, disciplined life. People had too much freedom. Listen, I've had it up to here with all that saintly stuff. The word proper is way too subjective. We gotta live as free as we feel. Oh, Elena, you are so straight-laced. I guess I'll never see eye to eye with you. Say, Ryudo, what do you think? Yeah, Ryudo. Whose side are you on? Thank you, both of you. I believe in neither darkness nor light. I believe in people. We gave our birth right away. We didn't trust in ourselves. But now, I'm going to return the world to its owners. That's just like you, Ryudo. Always taking the middle ground. <laughs> I guess so, huh? Well then, let's go! Um... Um... Uh, millennia? What do I do? Oh, jeez. Come on, Elena, don't you know? I... I see!
I think that's a really cool... This is just a cool image. Come on! Let's go! Got the wings of light and the wings of darkness. It doesn't get more epic than this, does it? Peaceful. We love it. Thank you, Grandia, for the peace. This part's a little whack to me. Like, I guess we got rivers now in there. I don't know where that water came from, but it's fine. <laughs> don't worry about it. One. Yeah. A year has since passed. The water-filled canyons of the Granite Cliffs have become a trade route, so our country is well visited. That's the end of Grandia, guys. I mean, there is a little bit more, and we're going to do a little bonus episode, because this finale's been long enough, and there's a lot to explore in there. Not like a lot, a lot, but a lot of story, a lot of stuff like that, so we'll do that in our bonus episode. Thank you guys so much for watching this series. It's been great. Subscribe if you haven't already. I love you guys so much. I'll see you in the next series which I do already have planned.